When we look at the analysis of polysulfate, we have 14% potassium, 6% magnesium, 17% calcium, and 48% sulfur. And it's in a sulfate form, which means it's readily available and the plants can actually take it up. Because polysulfate is a rock, when we apply it to the field, we get a prolonged release. It takes longer to break down in the soil profile. Research that we've done at Nottingham University, we found that poly releases its sulfur over about 50 to 60 days. But 60% of that sulfur is released in the first 10 to 12 days. So it meets the requirements of establishment of all crops in the UK. Polysulfate product has an SG of 1.6 which basically means if you take one litre of product and weigh it, it gives you 1.6 kilos. Ammonium nitrate has an SG of about 1.3. Again, if you weigh one litre of ammonium nitrate, you end up with 1.3 kilos. When we look at them in the bags, you can see that the polysulfate bag looks a lot smaller than the ammonium nitrate bag. This is to do with the specific gravity of the product and how dense it actually is. 